hi, welcome back to my channel or if you're new here, hello, my name is Katie and today I'm gonna to be reacting to episode seven of Chainsaw Man. The last episode was really wild. So basically Aki's devil hunting unit, which includes, and I'm gonna to try to pronounce the other names. I think it's Himeno and Kobanai. I think that's how you say their names. I can't remember the guy's name. Anyways, they are in this hotel because they have been led there by a piece of the gun devil's flesh and they believe that there is a devil residing in the hotel that has eaten a piece of the gun devil's flesh and so is more powerful than it should be and could also give them more indication as to where the actual gun devil is. And upon arriving at the hotel, they found themselves stuck on the eighth floor. Even going up and down the stairs, they were just stuck in this loop of being on the eighth floor, going into rooms that just led back out into the hallway and soon we found out that the devil that's in this hotel is the infinity devil or the eternity devil which makes sense as to why it's the eighth floor because like turn it on its side and that's the infinity sign i someone left a comment on my last video saying that and i was like Damn, that was like such a little detail that I didn't pick up on. Anyways, this devil wants Denji dead. It basically told the others, if you kill Denji, you can go. I'll let everybody else go, but the, it wants Denji dead. And so some of the unit were more willing than others to give him up to save their lives. In the end though, Aki basically protected Denji with his life and got stabbed by Kobanai and that was not great. Aki also mentioned about using his sword against this devil and Himeno really didn't want him to do that. I think it's some kind of risk to him to use his sword but I don't, we obviously don't know why, but you could kind of see, I mean, we have learned a little about him and over the last couple of episodes and she has a lot of trauma. She's had partners die. I think Aki is her sixth partner or seventh partner and she's seen a lot of death in this job and you could kind of see everything flash before her eyes when she thought she might lose Aki. And that was, that was a lot. We also saw small implications of Aki, Denji, and Power caring about each other in the last episode. And it's been, it's already building up. You can already see that they care about each other and they're like a little family. Like they're genuinely caring about each other on a really deep level. And I think that's really sweet. But the episode ended with Denji being like, I'm gonna deal with this, I'm gonna do this myself. And he is turning into Chainsaw Man and going right into the core of this death so I feel like we're gonna see the fight between Denji as Chainsaw Man and this devil and how the hell they're gonna get out of this hotel. I assume everything will go back to normal when they kill this devil, but we shall see. Anyways, before we get into the episode, if you do wanna see more content from me, don't forget to subscribe. You can also join my Patreon where I do upload a Patreon version of this reaction, which includes no watermark. It's at full volume and full opacity. And if you are at tier three, you get an uncut timer reaction as well. And there's loads of other early access content over on my Patreon as well. I do also wanna say a huge, huge thank you for 10,000 subscribers, which to me is so much. I started making reaction content because I wanted to get back into anime after watching a little tiny bit of it as a kid. And I just wanted to share this new hyper fixation with people. And I did not think it would take off like this. So thank you so much for supporting this channel. Genuinely, it brings me so much joy. I love doing this almost every day. I put my heart and soul into this channel. So thank you so, so much. I really really appreciate it and I hope I can keep bringing you content that you enjoy. But without further ado, let's get into episode 7 of Chainsaw Man. Mm. He's just gonna burst open his Chainsaw Man, right? Oh, that music! Oh my god. This music. Oh, oh, sh oh, the way his arm was just hanging off. He's just going for it. Did they know already like what he is? Surely they did, right? But maybe it's just their first time actually seeing him in action. 
Why is it... Why is it as if this devil has beef with him? Like, why does this devil actually want him dead? Oh my god. Maybe power can help him? Oh, he's ingesting the devil's blood. He's enjoying himself. Holy shit. <gasps> the voice of an angel. That must be her old partner. Fair. This, I'm very intrigued about this guy. He just seems to have seen some shit. You know, the statistics of devil hunters dying or leaving very early on, and he seems to have been in this a while. She's so... I can't even imagine how traumatized she is. Did she try to get him out of it? I wonder what the difference is in going private as opposed to being in public safety. I guess going private is just working for people as opposed to like on a government level. Jesus! Is he gonna be okay? Oh my god. <gasps> the fact he can heal from devil blood, I mean, it makes sense. That's pretty convenient when you're killing devils. She's like, you can kill the gun devil so that Aki doesn't have to do it. I feel like that's the way she's seeing it. Mm. Three days? Fuck, he's been doing this for three days? Jeez. How is he still alive? I mean, I know he heals with the blood, but still. And that canceled it all out. And they got another piece. She, not equating it to a huge shit. <laughs> I see his thinking, but still. The freaking trauma. We're gonna have a party? Oh. They're afraid of Denji. Oh, they feel mm, right. They feel guilty. As they should, though. Is that a piece of the gun devil's flesh? Oh my god. How did he find that? Makima is coming to the drinks party? Okay. 
Denji's just freaking made a name for himself, I guess. Mm, it's very sus indeed. Is secret of being chainsaw man? Is that what she means? Oh my god. I'm hungry. <laughs> I love her. <laughs> Oh. This is even more characters. Who are they? <laughs> he has a fiend? He's not thinking about food, he's thinking about kisses. <laughs> she didn't know he was that young. Oh, he's a good boy. He's only drinking tea. Wait, he has a contract with the fox devil too? <laughs> I mean... So she has a devil contract too, but she didn't like use anything in the in the hotel. His rookies were killed. Jeez. In terms of public versus private, I guess public gets all the hardest devils or all the scariest, strongest devils, whereas the private ones could just choose. I'm offering her his seat, Dougie. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. The fact that it's confirmed that he is 16. Uh, Makama. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. What is it more than he's just the chainsaw man devil? Like, is there something else about Denji that we don't know yet? <laughs> Everybody's getting pissed. I am power. Oh no. Makama has got to be like a devil or a fiend or something. I am on to her. <laughs> I love her. <laughs> oh, five. Mmm, yep. <laughs> no! I'm haunted. I'm disgruntled, haunted, and just traumatized. Poor Denji. Oh my god, Aki is so wasted! Where is she taking him? Um... Weren't you talking about his age? Didn't you bring him home? Yeah, I think you did. I'm 
I want to like her. But this is uncomfy. He's a child. You're joking. You're you're joking. She was shocked at how young he is and now this The retro vibe, okay. <gasps> the retro game vibe? This has to be the best one yet. <laughs> oh no. Not that. Oh, I love that ending. That was so good. With the song and the visuals considered, that ending had to be my favorite. Now, episode seven ending, that is my favorite. That episode was wild. That was so gross. I feel so gross. This is not good of Denji being groomed. Obviously, Himeno is older. You know, she was surprised that he's so young. So why is she doing this? I wanted to like her. I don't know. Their mission was successful though of getting the gun devil flesh, but oh boy, things are getting a little spicy. If you enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up and please do let me know what you thought of this episode in the comments. Of course, as usual, no manga spoilers, thank you. And if you wanna see more content from me, don't forget to subscribe. You can also join my Patreon where there's lots of early access content and lots of other stuff over there as well. I also have a second channel where I upload a lot of gaming content. So if that's your thing, feel free to subscribe over there. And you can catch me live on Twitch three to four times a week. So feel free to come and say hi in a stream sometime. But in the meantime, take care of yourselves and I'll see you in the next one. Okay, bye.